That wasn't so long of a wait, was it? I've patched the memories, and we're good to go back in the simulation. With Abstergo on our tails, we have to move fast. You can't blame me for being eager to get going. I won't blame you if you don't blame me for what happened earlier. It's just, Atlantis isn't our little secret anymore. Let's try to move on, shall we? Victoria, you have to trust me in there. I know what I'm doing. We're friends, Layla. But more than that, I'm your doctor. I can't ignore what's happening to your body when you're in there. Something is really off. I'm fine. I don't know how much more doctor talk I can take. Oh, I'll never get used to that. She comes out of nowhere. Glad you're back. Bet even you didn't see that Abstergo ambush coming, Alethea. Not exactly. Bet as long as they're gone and you're ready, your journey with the staff continues. After that cliffhanger in the pit of Elysium, you bet I'm ready. <laughs> I have to see what happens next. By interacting with the Keeper's insights in Elysium, Alexios exchanged knowledge with the staff. That means by extension of the Animus, so have you. I gotta tell you, I do feel stronger somehow. Try to keep your head in there. Good luck, Layla.
of mortal. Hades. The last mortal to dance with Cerberus and live was Heraclius. But then he had Athena and Hermes wrapped around his mighty finger. So tell me, who's wrapped around your finger? Which god helped you slay my beast? There were no gods in that pit. Just me and my spear. <laughs> so you did have help from the gods. I know who you are. What you've done. And I'd say you owe me, Keeper. It wasn't my plan to be thrown down that hole. But here I am. What do you want from me? Thanks to you, my realm is more chaotic than ever. With Cerberus gone, there's nothing to stop the dead from crossing over to the world of the living. So find another dog. You find another dog! I'm sorry you had to see that. The blood runs hot in my family. <clears throat> you did this, so I think it's only fair that you fix it. Fine. Tell me where you keep the multi-headed monsters around here, and I'll be right back. <laughs> no, 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 my dear Keeper. My realm, my rules. I have four gates. Instead of one guardian for them all, I want you to find me four guardians. One for each of them. The underworld is filled with kings, heroes, legends, all lost, all trying to find purpose. You could give them that purpose. The Cerberus was a fierce guardian. What human could replace him? No human could. A legend, though, immortal in the minds of the living, would strike terror in any who dared to cross over. Find me four of those. And if I don't find these guardians, then what? Boundaries between the world of the living and the realm of the dead will melt. The vile creatures locked away in Tartarus will roam free. Mortal souls will wander lost for eternity. And I will be very, very angry with you. Teach me how to use this staff, and it's a deal. Ah, yes. The trials of the Keeper. I've already heard how you'll stop at nothing to figure out that boring little stick of yours. This... Boring little stick. Tell you what. Go talk to my ferryman, Harun. Help him put things back in order. And I'll help you fulfill your destiny. <sighs> See what you've done? These are everywhere now. Fix it. Oh, I'll fix it. My brother and I have a little wager on whether or not you'll succeed in your quest. Don't let me down. You don't want to owe me twice.
three-headed beast, got yelled at by Hades, and now I'm on my way to meet the ferryman of the underworld. How was yours? The sun gives off no warmth. Ferryman. A busy ferryman. Someone just had to kill the guardian of the gate, and now I'm up to my eyeballs in rotting new covers. So, unless some god sent you to plug all the holes and clean up the mess between the realms, I don't want anything to do with you. It just so happens that Hades sent me. What did a shiny, living fleshling like you do to end up in debt to the god of the underworld? I, uh... May have killed Cerberus. Well, now that Hades' big dog is dead, rifts have opened all across the underworld. My passengers are being attacked by prisoners of Tartarus and all of his little dogs. Listen, I have to find four guardians to protect the gates and close the rifts. Hades said you'd need my help. Unbelievable. He sends a fleshling through the underworld to fix a problem only the dead can solve. Only the dead can solve. So that's why I felt so weak when I fought those things. The last fleshling who worked for Hades wore a special suit of armor, but he's been torn to shreds. Now the armor's been scattered across the realm. My mother told me my path would be tough, but she never prepared me for this. And you're going to have to fight some pretty vengeful warriors to collect four of the pieces. The fifth, a set of gauntlets, has gone missing. You... do fine. What did you mean exactly when you said little dogs? The hounds of Hades. Nasty little creatures who hunt and destroy the lost souls who want granted passage across the Styx by yours truly. You said something about prisoners. The Underworld's most horrific offenders are locked away in the prison of Tartarus. Many have escaped through the rifts and are putting the rest of us, hard-working, dedicated, passionate souls, in peril. What makes this armor I need so special? Forged on the bronze anvil that fell into Tartarus, it allows fleshlings like yourself to see things they shouldn't see go places they shouldn't go. Of course, Hades never mentioned this. He's very selective. Time to put this place back in order. All you need to do is collect some armor, defeat angry warriors, and find four guardians to protect the underworld. Right. Seeing as you're new here, I'll give you some advice. The Baron Pond, the Eternal Battlefield, and Hades Palace are all excellent places to start. And if you happen to have any spare time, I've got some work for you as well. Snap out of it, Perseus! We're allies, and I need your help! Go to the gates and protect this place! And go to the gates! If you want me to be a servant, prove it! Achilles, Hades needs you. Go to the gates and guard them with your life.
This place needs a king, Agamemnon. Go to the gates and protect the people the way you do best. I said, fight! Ugh. Heracles, rise up and be a hero for Hades, and for all the people in the underworld. Have mercy after all. Oh, Mistyos, your appearance is what I've been waiting for. Funny. You're the last person I want to see. Of course, of course. Our parting terms were less than amicable. You sent me to kill my father and tried to kill me! Which I now regret. Deeply. Seeing the underworld torn apart by chaos has shown me the error of my ways. If you think after everything you did, I'd believe a word you say? <laughs> Malaga! I'm not the same man you knew. I promise I can prove it. What a mess. Elpinor, I expect this to be cleaned up. Of course, Hades. And consider finding a more permanent solution to the mongers' attacks while you're at it. The mongers here too? The monger escaped Tartarus. He's continuing the cult's work by recruiting other escaped prisoners as they exit the rifts. I've seen them. They put up a good fight. We've captured one of them, but he won't tell me where the monger is hiding. Threaten him, perhaps? What makes you think I'd help you? Hades and I are close. And you need him to teach you about your staff. Helping me helps Hades. He'll appreciate this, Alexius. As would I, of course. Fine. But I'm doing this for myself. By Zeus. Not you again, Alpinor. Uh, I've heard enough of your spineless posturings to last two lifetimes. Sounds like you and I are on the same side. I can't stand Alpinor either. <laughs> You two seem pretty friendly to me. I'm the one who sent him here in the first place. He's a traitor to the monger's cause. Tell me where the monger's hiding, and I'll deliver Alpinor to him myself. All right, fine, fine. If only to shut you up. He's hiding out in the Lost Temple of Nyx. You'll never be able to take him down anyway. Exceptional. I've been tracking the monger from the moment the rifts appeared. There's just one problem. The lost temple of Nyx is behind the veil. The veil? Since Cerberus was killed, it spilled out into the underworld. The veil of Tartarus was created to keep out living mortals so that only those beyond redemption could enter the prison of the wicked. Which means you'll make it through just fine. But Heron said I would need armor. Yes. The armor of the fallen. Lucky for you. I may be able to help so we can both infiltrate the monger's hideout. You want to storm the monger's hideout together? Of course. A chance to fight alongside the mighty eagle bearer. No one would turn that down. Besides, this is my opportunity to prove that I've changed. Charon already told me that four of the armor pieces are guarded by the Fallen, but that the gauntlets were lost long ago. Charon tends to confuse lost with misplaced. Rest assured, I will help you find the gauntlets. Meet me at Kronos' treasury.
Alexios, I'm glad you've come. Would you blame me if I didn't? I learned your trust in time. And we can begin that process now. This door will lead us to Kronos' treasury, where the gauntlets you'll need are stored. I have the key here. If you want me to trust you, you have to start being honest with me. Why do you have the key? Hades had me tidy the treasury for him once. It isn't wise to steal from the Titans. The Titans fell long ago. No harm in using their tools to put a stop to the monger. So what? Your Hades is housekeeper now? I like to work for him only on occasion, that is all. Think of me as his mentee. Hades doesn't strike me as the mentoring type. There's much about Hades that you don't understand. I'll need those gauntlets if we want to catch the monger. My thoughts exactly. I'll offer my assistance as your personal guide through the treasury. Let's just get this over with. Of course, Mistyus. Whatever you need. Ah. Tread carefully. The prisoners of Tartarus have been known to attack this cave. Consider it, and then again, I might not. I'll see how I feel when I get there. There you are. You do realize how much time we could have saved if you had cleared the path. You left me to fend for myself. You seem to have made it here in one piece. Whatever here is. Kronos' treasury. Kronos hid all his worldly possessions here, far away from the sounds that had been prophesied to be his undoing. It was my favorite story as a child. 
All the myths, stories, and epics told throughout the generations were transpiring beneath us all along. And now we get to play among the gods, together. Let's find the gauntlet, quickly. Over here. These gauntlets will help me get past the veil. Thanks for your help. My pleasure, of course. All right, let's get out of here. We make the monger. Let's hear it. I'm ready. Exceptional. I'll distract the prisoners while you head straight to the monger. We can't let him escape. Once you defeat him, take him to the deepest abyss of Tartaros. You'll have to pass through the entrails of Gaia to get there. Entrails of... <sighs> Never mind. Let's go. make a good pair. At first I was worried you wouldn't stick to the plan. You haven't been very trusting of me. Can you really blame me? You and the cult destroyed my life. I have done nothing but try to redeem myself in your eyes. But still you refuse to give me a chance. I suppose you have changed a bit. My dear Eagle Bearer, you have no idea what your forgiveness means to me. Who said anything about forgiveness? I feel as though I can finally move on. Hades, I... we returned the monger to Tartarus for you, just as you asked. I made no such request. But you referred to the monger as a thorn in your side. And you inferred that I wanted him returned. Clearly you still have much to learn, Elpin. We'll discuss this later at my palace. Still, 
I'm on my way to eternal peace. Thanks to you. I believe you're forgetting something, brother. Why would you help your enemy find peace? I thought you and Elpinor were working together. Elpinor was merely a means to further along your far more interesting journey. Any chance this means you'll teach me more about the staff now? Patience, Keeper. A few more twists are still to come along your path. I'm looking forward to seeing how it all plays out. You used Alpinor as some sort of trial for me. Close. But the fates wove your path with a defter hand than that. What are you talking about? You'll know soon enough. Alexios returns. Victory written across his face. Where's your brother? Not here to settle any bets? It's already been settled. He lost. The gates have their guardians. Haron's lost souls have found peace. Now, tell me what you know about the staff. <laughs> I never promised you that. I promised to fulfill your destiny. Mastering this staff is my destiny, and you're going to show me. You were never in a position to bargain with me. Your life was mine. The moment you killed Cerberus, I could have had anyone place guardians at those gates. Truth is, I needed you to grow accustomed. What are you talking about? Oh, did I not mention? I have a fifth gate. And you're going to spend the rest of eternity protecting it. That is your destiny. I didn't bow to your wife. And I won't bow to you. <laughs> oh, you'll fucking bow. <laughs> Shame it has to end this way. You would have made an excellent addition to my dead hero collection. Collect this! All you pathetic humans end up here eventually. Why fight it?
don't see what's funny. You act like any of this matters. But you're a prisoner wherever you are. Victoria, what did you do? You guys okay down there? Cut the comms! This has gone way too far. I'm shutting this down. I can handle it. You're not acting like yourself. You're acting like a child. Look at you! Can't you see what the staff is doing? Plugging into Themos's memories. Letting you run rogue in the underworld? It's the bleeding effect. It's hurting you. You need to stop. Give it back, now! No! It's me or the staff! You have to choose! Let go! It's not worth it! This is for your own! Get up, Victoria! would never do this. Do this? Victoria was my friend. It wasn't me. This it... won't work. I need time. You think I did this on purpose? It was the staff, Alethea. I'm not a bad person. I don't kill. The air of memories in my vision had foresight. Your reaction was entirely human and inhumane. I fear you'll learn nothing from what I've created for you. I am the heir of memories. I can control the staff. Listen to me. I, I know I can do it. That is not for you to decide. I decide your worthiness. Though it may be too late for that. Fine. I'll go for a while. Just... Don't let anything happen to her, okay? And don't leave. Please. I'll be back. I'm not going anywhere. Damn it. I'm sorry, Victoria. But I can't quit now. <laughs> <laughs> 